Hi, this is KK for ADSR. I'm going to show you how to MIDI sync your MPC with Ableton Live, and then how to track out what you did from the MPC into Live. I'll be using two sound packs that you can get from ADSRsounds.com, the future of OVO and the vocal chops and melodics pack. Here's a sample of the final track. To hook up your MPC to MIDI Sync with Live, you'll need a MIDI to USB cable. The MIDI in cable needs to go to the out socket, and the out cable needs to go to the in socket. And the USB plug goes into a USB port in your computer. To MIDI Sync the MPC to Live, on your MPC, go to Shift 9, and then on Sync In mode, it'd be MIDI Clock, Sync Out mode, MIDI clock and the receive MMC should be on on the sync in and on the sync out. And that's it. Now to set up the MIDI sync in live, go to preferences, the link MIDI tab, make sure at the input USB MIDI interface under track is on and the output USB MIDI interface, the track is on and the sync is on. To sample into Ableton from the MPC, create a new audio track. To make sure your inputs are correct, you can press play in live, and that will trigger the MPC. And you can see if you're getting audio from the MPC. It was clipping there, but don't worry, because I'm going to be soloing each individual track and it won't be clipping then. To mute the tracks you don't want to record in, go to the track, and then on the parameter that says on, select no. That will mute that track. And the track that you do want to track in, make sure it's on yes. And now when you press record in live, it's going to trigger the MPC to start at the exact same time and everything's going to line up. Make sure your looping point is snapped to a measure. Arm the track. And hit record. Great, I'm gonna track in the rest of the instruments and finish the track in live. And now you can add other sounds, arrange it, and mix it in live. I've included this Ableton project file and all the loops and one shots I sampled into the MVC and then out. The link is in the description below. The great thing about this workflow is that you get the best of both worlds. You get the amazing iconic sound of an old school MPC and the flexibility of arrangement and mixing in live. Here's the final track. And let me know if you have any questions.